Uh, we're just kind of uh, nitpicking a little bit. Uh, we started out the practice and, and gave up our first couple laps, but uh, you get a couple good laps on the tires, and if you don't miss it, you don't look good on the sheet. But uh, good wrench car, uh, driving really good. Uh, it's just a little bit free right now, and that's I think that's the way we want it, but we'll have to wait and see. I don't think I'm a very good qualifier. I mean, or that we just don't hit on the setup for qualifying, but the last few weeks have been really good in race trim. Um, same car we ran at Pocono, so... We felt like we'd be good here. We tested here a few weeks ago with this car, and um, we, we started the session just like we left. And I told them when we left, I felt pretty good about it, so uh, apparently we were right. We did some race runs yesterday and kind of got ahead of the game, so this has kind of helped us out at this point. We got a long, long ways to go in the 500-mile race or the 400-mile race Sunday, and uh, we're going to need every bit of it because uh, start 36, we got a lot of cars to pass. But we got the car getting getting a little bit better and uh we still got some things to try some things to work on it'd be great if we could pick up a couple two or three tenths so i know everybody in the garage is like that but um we'd be we'd be uh hard to beat if we could uh run just a little bit faster right now we're just like everybody else it's okay it's not great but it's okay we're just trying to get it where i can run around other cars it's very difficult to pass so we're just uh trying to work on getting the front end to turn good enough when i'm behind somebody to get a run on them and uh and be able to pass and that's really difficult here so it's uh it's okay it's not uh you know perfect yet but we're working on it we're just going to continue to throw things at it, you know, and try to get an idea of what changes make what so we're adjustable for tomorrow. You know, depending on what the track conditions are for tomorrow, you know, our Dodge is, is running pretty well today, but tomorrow is another day. And, it, you know, you've got to be able to be pretty adjustable when these races start and be able to do it at a, at a good rapid pace to be able to keep up with what goes on as the race progresses. Well, Tony's uh, car is real comfortable looking uh, consistently fast uh, lap after lap. So kind of gauging off of what he's running is what kind of what we need to be running. He was running uh, 5180s, and uh, we could run flats and, and 90s and stuff like that. So we're not far off. So uh, just got to gain a little bit.